welcome to each topic in today's video i'm going to show you the practical question paper of pre-board exam 2021 kamrup district so here the first question is you have to create a table as the following as you can see on the screen so this is the table it have uh, three columns and four fields economics factor social factor political factors to create the table first you will open notepad in your computer then as uh, our table is here so i am making the window of not notepad according to that now first we will write html then head title and here migration it is the title of the table then title then head close after that we'll come to body section and let's read the question properly what it asks to do following create a table and provide this following information so your table doesn't have any name so we don't have to write caption tag here directly we'll start here table border equal one then t a t r and here t h the first line always will consider is table heading so economics factors then th will be close again th social factors so social factors th will be close again th then the third one is political factors th will be close then tr is close next again tr now instead of th we'll write td because uh, this is just data so lack of employment td again td then lack of education lack of educational opportunities again td then unfair legal system td will be closed tr will be closed now we have to to create two more rows which have a uh, we can copy this two and just paste two times and the inside value will change it so i am showing you in full screen this uh, two lines from tr will just change it uh, like you can see here in second line lack of food or se food or shelter so instead of employment we'll write lack of food so this way we'll change it and uh, we'll close your table then close body then close html then it's finished now you have to save the file for that you will go to file save as and uh, select the location anywhere you can save and you can say uh, select as desktop because it will be easy to search 
so write the name is any name you can give suppose i am writing table dot html and save it now on the desktop you will see the file as uh, i have already so many files here let's see where the table this one so this will be the output now we'll go to the next question now here is our question number two we have to write a javascript to display the factorial of our number suppose if we enter five then it should multiply all the numbers like uh, one two three four five then it should display the result as 120 and if the user enter a negative number it should display that please enter a positive number so let's go to a uh, editor you can use any editor first we'll declare variable variable will take three variables n i and fact and fact will define as one and the value of n will take from user so n equal prompt and here we'll write enter a positive number then we'll check the value of n whether it is greater than 0 or not n greater than 0 then we'll do some operation here again we'll write a for loop for i equal 1 i less than equal to n i plus plus then inside for loop we'll count the factorial so fact equal fact into i then inside the if only we'll display the value of apt effect so we'll write document dot write and here we'll write factorial equal plus fact so this one we did now if the number is negative so we'll come out from the if here we'll write else part else document dot write and here we'll write it as please enter a positive number so I have done now first we'll save the program file save and I'm writing this program in VS code if you want to install you can install in your computer and you can use it but if in your computer school computer this VS code is not available then you can write in notepad also now we'll go to desktop I have saved the file in desktop only we'll open the file so it asking me a positive number suppose I am entering minus 6 so it will display please enter a positive number now I'll enter a positive number say 4 so the answer will be 24 now let's enter 5 it's 120 now let's enter 9 it is 362880 so this way we'll write a javascript program to find a factorial of a number so you can write the program in your copy now we'll move to the third question this is mysql uh, <clears throat> create a table garments it's already in your book so it have this following field pr code it should be primary key category brand price and year of manufacture so for that uh, you will open mysql server in your school computer so here it will be mysql will be available or you can search the mysql in search box of your school computer then you will write the password you can ask your teacher for the password 1234 
now we have to create a table the table name is garmin so we'll first we have to create a database so create database test one i'm writing uh, giving the database name is test one now used test one now we have to write the database command for that i'm uh, table command for that i'm giving you one hint you write the command in notepad so that if any correction required then you can easily do it as on the mysql terminal you cannot edit the command so you can open notepad and write the table command here so our table name is garment we'll write create table garments then let's see what what field we have let's go to the question uh, question is here PR code category brand price year of manufacture and category here we have only four characters so that one also please remember so PR code character size will be four then primary key then we have a category category or item name let's go to the question again category brand price so category will have we can give worker size is 20 comma then uh, brand worker size is 20 comma then I think price and year of manufacture price and year of manufacture so price will give INT year of manufacture YOM it is year or debt let's see it is only year so we'll get 2016 to 1.6 then bracket close semicolon and we'll copy the code for copy you can use control plus C and go to the terminal here you press control and V or you can so it came here now you can just press enter key Oops. as I said while you are writing the command in notepad easily you can edit here year of manufacture data type should be here I gave 2016 so it was a mistake so again you copy it and go to the terminal and here right click so the command will come here now press enter so table is created to view the structure of the table we can write describe then garments so this is the structure of the table now let's enter the values to the table let's see what values are there in the first row tr01 trouser reach look 4000 so we'll write insert into garment values tr01 then trouser the brand is rich loop cost is 4000 and year of manufacture is 2016 except uh, integer everything right in under quotation so it's inserted now let's go to the next record so this is the next te1 tie reach loop 1500 as I have already copied this one TE01 
here tie rich look 1500 and here is 2017 so we'll write this and hit enter so record inserted I'm not going to insert all the record it will take time so just uh, now move to the queries first display the details of all garments in ascending order of price so we'll write here as all the garments so we'll write select star <coughs> select star from garments then order by price ASC so this will be the query for the first question select star from garments ASC now let's go to the second question display the brand and price of category trouser we need only brand and price so we'll write here select brand price comma price from garments garments is the table name where category equal trouser semicolon so you can see this one now let's move to the next question so this will be the query for the second number b question select brand comma price from garments where category equal trouser now we'll move to the question number c display the category and price of all product manufacturers in 2017 then we'll write uh, i forgot the question display the category and price so we'll write here select category comma price from garments where year of manufacture equal 2016 Oh, sorry I think it asking 2017 one so you will write 2017 so this is the answer for question number C so this way you can do the practical work of your class 10 uh, pre-board if you have any other question papers you can send to me in my Instagram account or in telegram Thank you for watching. See you in a new video. Till then take care and bye.